welcome to Treadmill Review Guru. Today we're reviewing the Soul CC81 Cardio Climber. So it works your whole body. It uses a stair stepper to work your lower body and then the handles also work your upper body as well. And it works your body vertically, so it'll work all the muscles, main muscles in your body. So let's jump into the full review of the Cardio Climber. We recommend the Cardio Climber for users who are looking for a quiet machine that gives you low impact training. It's also great to use in front of the TV or you can use your phone or tablet on the device rack and you can also connect to Soul Studio app through your phone or tablet as well. This isn't so great if you want a machine that has a large touchscreen attached. The console is pretty straightforward and it doesn't have a touchscreen so that's just something to be aware of. It's also really great for users of all heights because the handles can be adjusted pretty high so it can accommodate users that are shorter and also taller. The Cardio Climber is also really great because it'll give you a full body workout. So if you're looking for a machine that'll give you a full body workout in your home, you should check out the Cardio Climber. And it's also great because it doesn't require an internet to use the simple screen. So if you don't want to be connected and don't want to be connected to internet, you don't have to worry about that with the Cardio Climber. So let's jump into the overall construction of the Soul CC81. So the overall footprint, it is 86 inches high, 31 inches wide, and 59 inches long. It is a little bit smaller than ellipticals, but Something to be aware of is if you have low ceilings, it might not be best because it is pretty tall. The weight is centered in the middle, which keeps it from moving around a lot. If you do pick up speed, you can get a little bit of movement, but really there's no rocking. There's four leveling feet under the two stabilizers, so it does stay firmly planted when you're on it. It's a full body workout on it but you can also do targeted training. So if you want to work your lower body, you can put a little bit more pressure into your lower body or your upper body to kind of get isolated targeted training that way, or you can just use it completely and it will give you that full body workout that you're looking for. It has a pretty low step up height at about 10 inches from the lowest pedal to the ground. So it's pretty easy to get on and off. If you do have mobility issues though, you might wanna use some caution. And also the pedals, they're about 15 inches long and they have a nice texture so they can grip your shoe to help so your feet don't slip. And then they also have this ridge around the front part so you don't have to worry about your foot slipping off. And they were actually developed with a physical therapist. So they're designed to take off extra pressure off of your knees and ankles. So you don't have any extra stress on those when you're working this. So it really keeps it that low impact workout, which is really great. And it uses magnetic resistance. So it's really quiet. There's really minimal noise and it has 20 levels of resistance, which we found to be plenty amount of resistance and tension for you to pedal and use the handles against. And the handles adjust, so they adjust four ways all the way up to keep the handles pointed this way, or you can flip them out to the side. They adjust four ways as well. I'm about five foot and a half, I guess we'll say, barely over five foot really. So just the low two notches work best for me. The upper two will not work because they're too tall, but they're great for taller users and it gives a really great range for that. And also when you switch out the handles, you can either keep them pointed this way or when you flip them out to the side, it will work different muscle groups, which is really cool. And the overall stride length, since it moves up and down like a stair stepper, is about 12 inches. So you get enough range to really work that lower body as well. So Soul offers a really nice warranty on the Cardio Climber. They offer a lifetime warranty on the frame, five-year warranty on parts and electronics, and a two-year warranty on labor. Thanks for watching this video so far. 
If you like it, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel so you can stay up to date in all the latest in fitness equipment. So now let's dive into the console on the Cardio Climber. So the console is pretty straightforward and simple, and it's easy to use, it's easy to reach, especially when you're working out. The screen here just displays your workout metrics and also gives you different workout choices. So there's six onboard workouts, that's including the manual mode, so really I guess there's five preset workouts. So you can choose from hill workout, fat burn, cardio, strength, and high intensity interval training. So these are preset with preset resistances, but you can go in and change it as you go. So if you want more intensity, you can add more, or you can take away some of that resistance if you want less in those. So that gives you options as well. And I also really like just being able to jump into the manual mode and kind of do my own thing. So you adjust the resistance down here. It goes up to level 20 and it starts from level one. So you have plenty of option there. So that is really, easy and straightforward to use and we really like this simple console. And it also has this nice device rack on the top here where you can place your phone or tablet and it'll slip right in and this little ridge will hold and also up top here will clip into place. I've set my phone vertically on it and it holds nice and still, especially when I'm really getting into a good workout. So that's really nice to have. Plus we really like the two large water bottle holders it fits my 22 ounce water bottle plenty and then there's also room. And when I'm working out with my water bottle in, there's no rattling or anything, so that's really nice. Plus they give you a little bit extra storage, so if you wanna place your phone down here or maybe your wallet or keys, you have that option as well. Something else to consider is that there isn't a fan, so that's just something to be aware of. If you do need extra air, you'll have to plug in uh, your own fan at home. and your heart rate will be displayed on the screen with the compatible heart rate chest strap that comes with it. So it will connect, once you have the chest strap on, it will connect and show your heart rate on screen. So Soul also does offer a fitness app. It's called Studio and it's $19.99 a month. And you can use it on your phone or tablet when using the Cardio Climber. I use it on my phone and just place my phone right here. And they have a, around over 3,000 trainer-led classes, which are really great. They have elliptical classes, which work great for the cardio climber. Plus they also have a uh, treadmill, um, rowing classes, also uh, indoor cycling classes, and classes off, off the um, equipment as well on the mat, like meditation or yoga or strength classes. So you can get even more out of your workouts. So that's really great, but the, that monthly subscription is definitely not required to use this machine. So it just gives you a little extra, um, extra options, which is really nice. So now let's go over the overall functionality of the Soul Cardio Climber. So it is a climber machine. So it works your body vertically. And when you're going, it is a little bit of a learning curve to kind of get the hang of. Since it's not an elliptical, it doesn't have that little bit of forward momentum. So as you're going, you can kind of get yourself side to side, but really when you bend your legs a little bit more and keep your body still is when you really get the most out of this workout. And when you first step on it, it does tilt you forward a little bit. So uh, I noticed a little bit of extra pressure on my toes and knees. So I try to push a little bit more through my heels when I'm doing that stair stepper motion. So it's just something to be aware of, but we do notice that you can get a pretty serious workout on this, so it's really great for that. And what's really nice is the handles adjust, so they have four different points to play with for height. I'm just over five foot, so really just the two lower notches work best for me. And then you can have the handles this way, or you can clip them in and tighten the handles and they are ready to go this way as well. So they will point outwards and this just lets it work even more muscles in your upper body, which is really cool. So now I'm going to show you the noise output, which is relatively low.
So as you can see, the magnetic resistance keeps this machine pretty quiet. So the cardio climber, it doesn't fold, so that's just something to be aware of, but it can be moved pretty easily. There's two wheels on the front stabilizer and then a handle in the back. So you can pick it up and wheel it. So it moves around easily. You probably just need to be aware of the height of it since it is pretty high. So it's not best for low ceilings, but it moves around really easily. So a few things to keep in mind with the cardio climber is that it's a little bit larger than other climber machines, yet it's smaller than most ellipticals. And it doesn't fold up, so this is going to be how it will stay in your home. We really like that it utilizes upper body training, so it'll work your whole upper body from your arms to your chest to your core and back as well. And the large oversized pedals move up and down about 12 inches, so they really target your lower body as well. Plus, overall, you'll get a low impact workout in the comfort of your own home. And another thing that we like is that it's quiet. So the noise output is really low because of that magnetic resistance. And it has a large weight capacity at about 400 pounds so larger users can use it as well. And the handles adjust so taller and shorter users can also use it as well because those handles adjust up pretty high and pretty low. Soul also offers a really nice uh, lifetime warranty on the frame, which really speaks to the durability and solid construction of the cardio climber. So that's really great as well. So thanks for watching. If you want to learn more about the Cardio Climber, check out our written review at treadmillreviewguru.com. And you can click the link below for current pricing. And like and subscribe this video. That way you can stay up to date in all the latest in home fitness equipment. And also let us know in the comments what you think about this machine, what you think about other treadmills, all the other products that uh, we test, maybe something that you would like to see us test. Let us know, we'd love to hear from you. Thanks again for watching. I'm Sydney with Treadmill Review Guru. I'll see you next time.